Na wafanyakazi wa kampuni ya kusambaza maji ya Busia Buwasco wamefunga ofisi za kampuni hiyo kwa kutumia misumari na mbao wakidai mishahara yao ya zaidi ya miezi kumi. Wafanyakazi hao kutoka maeneo mbalimbali walijawa na ghadhabu walikongamana katika makao makuu ya ofisi hizo kwa kauli moja wakaamua kufunga ofisi hizo na kusitisha huduma mara moja. Point is Okay listen. Ah ngoja kwanza. Ngoja kwanza listen. Juhudi za mkurugenzi huyu wa Buasco Thomas Lukeo kuwahimiza wafanyikazi hao zaidi ya 80 kutofunga afisi hizi ziliambulia patupu. Wakimkaribia na kusema kuwa kwa muda wa miezi mitatu tangu ajiunge na kampuni hiyo hajafanya chochote kushughulikia masaibu yao. Ili mlazimu kutizama afisi hizo zikifungwa pasi na uwezo wa kuzuia. Mimi kilio changu ni kulipwa haki yetu ambayo tumefanyia kazi. Alafu at least hata wakiongea kuwe na kuongea kusema ni nini inatusumbua kwa sababu hata wenye tuko nao hawatuambii tumefika hapa kwa sababu gani. Changamoto ni nyingi zaidi hata kushinda vile tulitoka Lake Victoria North. Sasa Lake Victoria North hata kama ulikuwa uko contracted staff bado ungefeel kwamba we ni mfanyakazi. Hii kampuni si atimeanza jana, hii kampuni ilianza muda wa nyuma huko. Wakati ilitoka Western mpaka ikafika ikawa Buasco. Na ilipokuja huku ilikuja kwamba watu wa Busia tujitegemee, tujisaidie wenyewe. Na zile vitu ambazo tulikuja nazo, tulitumwa nazo kukuja huku nazo zingine hata zimekwama. Uh, tukiangalia kama matangi zetu zimekwama na sisi tulipochukuliwa tulichukuliwa na county government ya Busia ya kwamba hawataki kushare mambo yao na Kakamega. Wafanyikazi hao wamesema kuwa ukosefu wa maji kwa zaidi ya miezi sita kwa wakazi wa Busia umesababishwa na deni la stima na ukosefu wa kemikali ya kusafisha maji yanayosambaziwa wenyeji. Kile tumeamua leo kuanzia leo we are not offering any services. Yes. 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 Tumekuwa tukisupply maji but supply yetu imekuwa erratic. Tunaweza supply wiki moja na tukose kusupply kama mwezi moja, miezi miwili, tena tukipata chemical kidogo tulipe stima tena tu supply. So our supply has been very erratic because ya mambo mawili stima na kemiko. Waziri wa maji na mazingira kaunti ya Busia mhandisi Andrew Meso amekiri kuwepo na changamoto nyingi katika kampuni hiyo akisema kwamba wafanyikazi hao wana uhuru wa kulalama. You may know that uh, Boasco as a company has been having financial challenges for a period of time, for a longer period, three, four years. We are setting up, we have come up with a, a board. Previously, the, 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 the company has run for two years without a board. I, I still remember, I want to emphasize that we are addressing historical issues, some of them whom, which we, we inherited. The accumulated bill was about 13 from the records I got. We are about just 2 or 3 millions to go to complete. Waziri huyo wakati huo huo amewahimiza wafanyikazi hao waliogoma kurejea kazini akisema kwamba mikakati ya kuwalipa marupurupu yao imewekwa. Hata hivyo wafanyikazi hao wamekaidi ombi hilo la kurejea kazini huku afisi hizo zikisalia mahame kwa siku ya pili hii leo. Jane Cherotich Runinga ya Citizen Busia